Alright, on to wetlands. No more stalling. Yeah, my professions are sorted, man. I got NG basically up to 180. Maybe even 190. 200 if I get a bunch of iron. It's just like, I don't have to even think about engineering anymore. NG is sorted, like, done. Yeah, I can smelt one silver. Well, more than one. It's a low chance. I'll find one tin. There's no way I don't find tin. And here's the thing now, yeah? What am I gonna do with my tin? Uh, well, I can just smelt it and sell it. I don't know how much it is on the auction house, but a bronze bar is six silver. So, one tin is equal to 12 silver because copper is like 20 copper each tin makes two bronze so each tin is 12 silver bro and you're probably asking why are people paying so much for bronze so they can get to iron only 27 dude i might as well be worth first right now like yeah i'm only 27 but with the amount of engineering i have when you factor in what what is this engineering worth in levels 30 levels at least now copium bro like Trust me, dude. All I gotta do is not die. Yeah, so if I die, then I wasted all this time. 92 back. silver. Boys, I know my gold is low. And I can't afford to train level 28 spells. I just gotta stay alive, dude. Like, this is this is good, bro. Even though I'm, like, obviously behind a lot of our people in levels. Like, my profs are sorted. I, I just know for a fact, like, most people that are, like, higher level, they, they probably skip profession. Your bags are full all the time. You gotta worry about it. You don't have time for this. Just don't die now. That's the most important thing. Just don't die. If I die after getting NG 167, bro, I'm gonna be pissed. And I gotta get better shoulders. Can you believe I'm using D shoulders still? What am I gonna do? Am I gonna use the May shoulders from, like, the uh, level 29 raptor quest? They have spirit and intellect and bear what i have imagine if i die to gray mob something <laughs> that'd be so funny bro i swear this is the last time i'm killing gray mobs man i'm not even trolling like i'm not gonna kill any more gray mobs. like it, it, there's no way dude infinite gold per xp if i grind these gray mobs for like 10 hours then i will have some gold and i'll stay the same level warriors can barely handle three gay mobs <laughs> three gay buffs. Oh shit, this guy's green. Gotta be careful, boys. One at a time, okay? If, it, if they're green, one at a time. Now, I'm not worried about my gold. Like, of course, I'm gonna be cocked for, like, a few levels. Like, I can't afford to train spells. Spells are one gold each. I got, like, four more spells to train. But it's gonna ramp. Like, keep in mind, I spent 50 silver just, like, training, like, NG. Like, to, to go to over 150. Plus, like, another 50 silver on just training the engineering things. And I'm gonna do the same with mining. Another 50 silver there. No, I kind of like being poor, man. I gotta be careful now. So, I think two mobs come here. Uh, so, okay, this is dangerous. Not looking good, boys. Okay, we gotta reset this. Damn. Uh, we, maybe you gotta retail. Now, they come together. Those mobs always come together. You can't separate. I mean, you, I don't think you can, because I can't even throw a grenade down there, you know, like to separate them. So, it's just how it is. Oh, I got male shoulders from that mob. Like, a hundred more armor. That's actually massive. A nice cloak as well. I could sell that cloak to a mage. Now, we got this. Now, we got this. Go for the sailor. Emo shout thunderclap. Wait for the auto attack. Now, on this guy. Now, I, I probably gotta reset him, but I'm gonna try my luck. Not looking too good, though. Nice overpower. We needed that overpower there. Yeah, that would have been close. The disarm is so bad. I mean, I can also disarm him. From my experience, dude, like this arm, like you gotta go defensive stance, spend 20 rage, and they still hit you with punches, which actually deal a decent amount of damage. It ain't that valuable. I mean, if there's a mob that hits like a truck and disarming him makes him like hit where like it's not too bad, that's fine. But like that situation ain't worth it. Yeah, I rarely use it. Like this mob has a dagger, right? So like he's hitting me for 33, 31. I disarm him. 19. I mean, it's a diff it, it is a difference, right? But it's not like you're taking no damage. Yeah, we're gonna blow through these NG items. Actually, maybe not too hard, though. I need to keep some until I get the iron grenades. Yeah, we're not really over-leveled anymore. We're, we're, we're at the level that we're supposed to be. I haven't done stockades, that's why. If I did stockades, then I would be 28, and it would be kind of easier. Yeah, here are my talents. I didn't go Fury for the crit chance, I went straight arms. Am I drinking beer? No, having Arizona iced tea peach. Actually, this thing doesn't have... It doesn't have any sugar. It's 100% natural tea, no sugar in it. Dude, I just realized every time I use a wool bandage, I am spending 4 silver worth of wool lot from the auction house maybe i should eat more food and uh, use less bandages uh, bandages are faster than food but are they way faster i'm gonna be honest dude like as a human warrior you have a bunch of spirit you know like your health goes up fast like when you're eating really like it goes up really 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 fast like how much time am i really saving by bandaging like maybe a few seconds oh shit oh shit we're in trouble I think it's a retail angle. Retail angle. Good retail right there, bro. If I didn't retail there, um, I don't know if I can kill those mobs with potting and, 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 and nading. May maybe, bro. It's, it would be close. And the thing is, you can't run away in the water. You can't fear them. That's why you retail. Like, that. that's a retail angle. You don't have time to think. It's like when I died on my mage, you know? You have to 
act instantly if you take time to act you lose that's why it's harder to level at lower levels by the way you don't have options when i died on my mage what were my fin options jump faster and maybe kill them up it's like you don't have anything and nothing nothing you don't have abilities you don't have like uh, grenades but when you're higher level you have so many more options and that's why it gets easier but the mobs are very hard okay i believe in this tin one of these will be up and i will yes this is it boys this could be 125 mining unlocking iron nodes wait that's a level 29 raptor defending it cheeky hamstring maybe getting dodged no dodge on the hamstring surviving and execute that's how strong that mob was okay come on 125 yes we did it boys now the crazy thing is right each one of these and i'm not kidding about this is worth 10 silver on the auction house essentially when you can make it into bronze bars and sell them 12 silver sorry not 10 12 so i just made 48 silver because i don't need them anymore i can just sell them oh so 10 is still really 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 valuable but yeah for now it will go down yeah it will go down i think bronze will probably stabilize at like four silver maybe three expected to decrease substantially yeah i feel so much better today than yesterday yesterday i was awake for like 36 hours in the end almost 37 hours and my brain was like turned off i wasn't thinking logical i was just existing in the game now i'm like everything makes more sense to me now how was burger king awful as always <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, man. Burger King fell off so hard. Dude. The fries from Burger King are so bad nowadays. Oh, we got the bag. Like, they're so bad. I used to say that the Burger King fries are better than McDonald's. Like, seriously, but nowadays, no, man. They're like, they even taste like food. Zarya already has Mount. No way Zarya has 36 gold. I mean, maybe his viewers gave him gold. Like, the thing about me is I don't really take handouts from viewers. Uh, I've only taken, like, one gold so far, almost. This weapon and this ring. And also two bags. That's it. Otherwise, you know, like, I, I'm, I've been pretty, pretty much solo. Can you imagine somebody, like, clicks on my stream expecting to see word first level 60 mage AoE farming gameplay, and instead they see a level 27 warrior killing gray mobs? <gasps> yeah, unlucky, dude. I might get my sub money back. I believe this quest here gives you a, uh... Yeah, look at that chest, dude. Two stamina, eight spirit. That's really good, actually. I would say that beats my three. I, I think eight spirit beats three strength. And it also has more armor. Yeah, that's a lot more HP regen. Isn't it less damage? Yeah, less damage, but you will uh, save a lot of time. Eight spirit is a lot. Eight spirit is uh, insane at this level. I mean, it's debatable, though. I'm not, like, 100% sure about it. But I think eight spirit at level 27 is better than three strength. Might be wrong about that, though. Be careful. Level 28. Nice. Plus 1% damage, pretty much. I think that's how that works. You just do 1% more damage. I don't know if I'm doing the Whirlwind Axe quest. As an alliance, you can do the uh, SM quest at like 37. Let's say 38. Right, you do the SM. Uh, and you get a better weapon. You get a better weapon than the Whirlwind Axe. Uh, how's 1 to 60 compared to 1 to 80 in Wrath? It's slower. Uh, not by a lot, though. I think 1 to 80 well, takes a long time as well. Because the last 5 levels are really slow. Damn, those legs are good. I guess that's why you can't take the staff from the Dead Mines quest because you get those legs. Or next time we take the staff. I don't know about those legs. I mean, I've been using these for a long time. I've been using these for almost 10 levels. You look like you're enjoying more Warrior than Mage. It is way more fun, man. Like, it might not look fun just killing one mob at a time. But I have to explain this to you. The Mage AoE farm route. AoE farming is nice. But there's so much bullshit that you have to do. Like, for example, where that Mage died. That part is terrible, man. Like... It is pure pain and suffering. Uh, there's cer like certain areas like that. When you have to press Frostbolt on a mob or Fireball with zero talents in your Fireballs. You're, you're pressing 3.5 second Fireballs as Mage. It feels so wrong and bad. But you have to do it because sometimes you have to quest. And you're not going to go respec to single target, right? To quest. No. You can't afford to do that. So you stay with the AoE spec by pressing Fireball. Same here, by the way. When you come here as a mage, after you're done at level 25, it is awful, dude. But then it gets good when you AoE farm. And it feels it feels worth, you know. Ups and downs. Mages, ups and downs. I mean, it's not for everybody, right? Like, do you like AoE farming the same mobs for 10 hours in a row? Some will say yes, some will say no, right? I think it's a lot of fun the first time you do it. But then once you've done it many times, you've leveled a lot of mages to 60. You're like, oh, here we go again uh no potion will work okay let me explain like if you have your potion on your keybinds 
Yeah, like you should keep on your potion, by the way. If you, if you have a potion in your bags, uh, put it in your bag on your bars, right? But if you if you don't do that and your potion is in your bags, you open your, your bags and then you right click. Yeah, it won't work if Bagnon is bugging. I don't know why this happens. It's like rare, but it happens. No, don't do like I did. But in the clip where I died, I opened my bags and I put it. But the thing is, my bags were open because I was heartstoning from my bags, which you should also keybind. I'm like, I, don't, I always heartstone from my bags. I rarely keybind it. So yeah, if you're trying to heartstone from your bags and you get the bug, then you can't heartstone. So I had my bags open, so my pot oh, I got pot anyway. I might as well click it here. Yeah, you click heartstone, dude. I don't know. I just I don't keep my heartstone. It probably takes me more time to press H on my keyboard than to open my uh, my bags and click heartstone. Yeah, then I got a petty. I got a petty. Yeah, yeah. See, I got a petty on my auto attack, so I couldn't hamstring. It was so bad. Great to meet you. Nice level 29. That was a one hour six minute level. That was fast. That was like more than twice as fast as the level before it. But I was like doing professions. You know? Okay, now we are going to uh, have a very hard time. The next 20 minutes can be uh, the last 20 minutes of this character. I don't know, dude. I'm gonna mess this up, man. All right, here we go. I'm either gonna like I can't die doing this, right? Ah, right, here we go. Okay, good. That's step one. I don't know, bro. <laughs> um, looks easy to me. Uh, I, I, I didn't, it didn't work, guys. Yeah, maybe I gotta step back, bro. I just, I, 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 I pressed my space bar as well, man. I, I pressed my space bar, dude. I don't know, man. I have this habit when I'm on the edge of something and I have to jump. I have to like press W and jump at the same time. Like sometimes it doesn't work. I have to press them exactly at the same time. Well, it's fine. At least we didn't die or something. I don't know. If you if you just step forward a mi a microsecond, like uh, before you jump, then you just fall in that situation. Right? These guys are really hard, man. Gonna have a food buff here for sure. The issue is like yeah, I can leash pull, right? We gotta take them one by one. I think I can pick this up without this guy pulling, so I just kill this guy. Petty, petty, poison. Pretty bad. Three. Refresh the Sunders. Poisoned me again. Anti Venom. Poisoned me again. Petty. Please don't die here. Bot. Execute. I had to use so many things, man. Just one mob, one normal mob. I was so worried. I, I, I used my Vestal Balm, put it, dude. I used Grenade to pull Grenade again. Fear Bandage. If that auto attack went through after the fear, I would have actually died there, I think. Dude, that guy was so hard, man. Like, he, he did a lot of damage. Like, his auto attacks were crazy. Okay, so we are going to Ashen Vale and Stone Talon Mountains now. This might get... A bit ugly. See, I would skip this, by the way. I would skip all of this if I could find a dungeon group right now. If I could find, like, Stockades group or RFK, like, with the guild, I would just skip. Because I'm trying to play with the guild. It's nice to do it at 30, but if you do it at 29 and you get the axe, like, you get to use the axe an extra level, it's, like, so good. What is this group? Stockades? Is this Stockades? Okay, I'll, I'll do Stockades then. My Nuts is in this group. My Nuts is a, a troublemaker, guys. So, here's the thing about My Nuts. We played on... Uh, EU with him. Both Dal Rens drop. Both of them in the one kill. First time we've seen them. And I was there on my warrior parry. And I passed them for him because, you know, he was DPS and I was tank. He wins both, both Dal Rens. Then he goes one hour later in winter spring to level up weapon skill. And dies. I don't think we ever saw double Dal Rens again. However, he's a gamer, right? Sounds like a you problem. Is that, is that a me problem, man? Uh, what? Yo, there's a warlock. I'm expecting a summon, guys. All right, I'm, I ain't gonna move my ass. You guys summon me. That's what. That's the deal here. Okay. This is a uh, pretty good group. I'm actually the highest level. This guy called me a dirty girl because of my axe. Oh, this guy's not inside yet. I gotta be a bit careful. I I feel like I was gearing way too greedy. Oh, look at my nuts going AFK, guys. 
We don't have a healer here yet. Respawns, he said. Oh, no, respawns after dungeon. We need to finish quests. Oh, yeah, these guys are going to do stockades twice, they said. Yeah, there's six quests, but no one has the sixth one because you got to do like the elite quest in wetlands first, which is really stupid. Yo, kill level 34 elite mobs so you can like do a level 23 elite mob dungeon. You guys think someone's going to die in this group? Or is this, is this a gamer group? Because these are not the guild. These are uh, actually hardcore elite. One guy's from hardcore elite. This guy's from pulp. This guy's also a hardcore elite. Hardcore elite is like the the guild that almost cleared Naxxramas, right? Because I thought they weren't gonna play the game. I, from what I heard, like they hate uh, they hate like this uh, these servers. From what I heard, but maybe there was only a few people in the guild that think like that, and they were like loud minorities. Or maybe these guys just took their name because it's a cool name. I don't know who told you that. That's what I heard, man. Like I was, I was uh, watching the aftermath of the uh, the, the grief, and uh, it was like a talk. You know, people were talking on Discord. And it was the, the comments were being streamed. We were saying the the officer team. There's a few of them don't want to do the server. They don't like it, and there's like a divide in the guild. Only the raid leader and main tank isn't pretty much the GM, and everyone else it is. Oh, so it's like only a few people then. Okay. But they were like in positions of power of the guild. Yeah, I just remember hearing that conversation happening because of the after. I was watching Bean stream and Bean was streaming the comms. We were talking about like the ordeal and someone brought up like these servers coming out. And then it was like, yeah, but I'm not sure we're playing because of like XYZ. Uh, so it's not like that then. So it's only a couple people. So the guild is still here then. I thought the guild wasn't even gonna happen. We have two like very serious guilds on the server at least. Is that me swiftness spots? Thanks. I need to remember to buy water breeding. After the stockades, it is auction house time. But we're not gonna spend one hour on the auction house. I am just going to buy five water breeding potions and figure out how to get 175 NG. That's it. Buy troll blood potions, they are OP. Are you guys doing that? Are you buying alchemy elixirs that make you stronger? Like, how, how expensive are they? Like, agility elixir, you know. 770 XP from that guy. Nice. Thank you, Lostino, a lot for the 17 months. I appreciate that. Server maintenance in 45 minutes, by the way. Okay. Yeah, we won't do any questing until after that. I mean, we gotta do finish this dungeon and then figure out the stuff. I mean, I, don't, I could not go back to Ashen Vale, but all that iron kind of made me... A, how do you say, man? Like, you saw that, right? Like, that, that's where you want to be, boys. That's where you want to be, dude, for the iron. So I should go back. That place is full of mithril or iron. Dude. Okay, four mobs, don't panic. Don't panic, don't panic, don't panic, don't panic. Where's my heals, man? Heal me, heal me, heal me. Chat, is it bad to not train your revenge? Because I only have rank 1 revenge. Like, I don't know how it works. Like, does revenge generate aggro based on the damage of revenge? Or does it generate aggro because it's called revenge and it just generates a lot of aggro? If it's based on the damage, then, like, feigning it makes a lot of sense. Rank 1 revenge is fine, is it? It has a fixed amount plus damage modifier. So the fixed amount is the big one. Rank 1 is fine, okay. Sometimes you get unlucky in this dungeon and, yeah, look what happened. One out of eight, one out of eight. Little bro turning his back to the mobs. I know what I'm doing. I've tanked in retail, okay? Like, I think I can tank stockades. Like, I've even tanked Zulgurub on hardcore. Have you tanked Zulgurub on hardcore? I main tanked it once. With no Petri in my bags. I'm not gonna be a bitch on this warrior. On this warrior, I'm gonna go all in, boys. I'm not gonna be a cameraman. No cameraman, bro. If you Petri, your character should get instantly deleted. I mean, I don't know, man. It's in the game, bro. It's in the game at this point. You have to just embrace it. Whether you like it or not. That's why I call myself Petrisha, you know? I am embracing the Petri. I got Petri in my name. Tanking with a two-hander feels kind of wrong in hardcore. Like, it's easier to have aggro when you have a two-hander. If I use a shield and a sword, like... Three out of ten, and you have seven. How do I have three and you have seven, bro? Yeah, I, I played out Dwarf and I played out Thorin. Uh, level 60 hardcore. So I didn't have the five weapon skin. I just, you just feel it, you know? Like, feel it because you have to use different gear. You literally have to use gear that's like, that has hit. So you can make up for the hit you lose. And you're missing out on crit chance every time. Every time you get 1% hit because you need more hit because you're not a human, you're losing 1% crit. It's devastating. Not to mention you're losing the what what, what weapon skill does to your glancing blows, right? We're not even talking about that. Wait, you have 10 bandanas! You have 10 and I have 3! My nuts has 10 already, bro. How can you be like 3.5 times luckier than me? Dude, I swear, the skill diff is the worst thing I ever read in chats. Every time somebody uses the word skill diff, like, uh, I, I get so mad. I mean, as a tank, you should get the most because you're like in melee range when the mobs die, you know? I don't know if he's gonna come by himself. Let's see. No. 
Pain Lightning, careful, we're all stacked! would imagine if that one shot. Holy shit, that damage. Whoa, 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 whoa! What is that damage, man? He popped Bloodlust. Jesus, I was getting crit so much as well. Yeah, I think he buffs them up so they, they just deal, like, they don't really attack faster, they just hit harder. Like, 169 is very hard, you know? Yeah, we might be missing one convict, that sucks. Oh, uh, man, I hope there's a convict in the other room. Yeah, it's like RNG, and I need six more bandanas. I'm probably not gonna be finishing that. But in one hour and 30 minutes, I can. Hey, that's what that's what's like about playing on an NA server. Their reset happens during the day for me. OP, bro. Okay, two people finished the bandana quest. Lucky bastards. Now, here comes the boss. AoE smoke bomb. Dude, what the f? Dude, that guy's dangerous. Dude, what the hell? Yeah, he just kept spamming like the, the smoke, dude. Did we finish the quest? Oh my god, dude. I'm so mad, actually. Do we just wait for respawn? Like, one convict. Yeah, one convict, bro. Like, the bandanas is fine. I'm so far off that it's fine. But, like, one convict.